Hey everyone, welcome back to Freedom City 1165, that's in uh, Surviving Mars, Below and Beyond. Okay, so um, we're uh, a little bit short on uh, machine parts. Um, <clears throat> we're a little bit short on people, uh, partly because we, uh, we gave some uh, help to uh, the new... Uh, uh, competitor China that will pay off in the future but it causes a little bit of pain now the uh, uh, now what we uh, what we need here um, uh, where, where are we at here um, what we need the uh, we need all of this stuff that's broken to get fixed, and we're producing um, uh, machine parts uh, at a decent rate. So, uh, now we've just come through a disaster, uh, and that uh, that broke just about everything. So, uh, that's partly why everything is uh, taking. Uh, uh, so long to uh, sort out uh, but we need to get the machine parts uh, deficit sorted out uh, and that is uh, gonna take a minute a couple of sols at least uh, gene adaptation is uh, a couple sols away um, so that's gonna take uh, a minute or two as well um, right so uh, we do have plenty of power uh, to charge our batteries. Uh, we have repaired our polymer factory. So now we're going to be uh, producing some polymers again. Uh, we are... Uh, what? We need uh, the fuel refinery to be repaired. And once that's done... Um, Where's our uh, broken transport? It's over here. Uh, where are you? Okay, I can send you over to the broken transport. Okay. Um, that's going to be a long drive, but it will... Uh, it will make, uh, you know, some... Uh, some progress there. Uh, yeah, we don't have enough fuel to do another uh, planetary anomaly, so uh, we'll just let uh, let China scan one. Because we don't have any choice, really. Uh, we are now producing um, fuel again. Uh, that is going to be useful. Uh, we are three water in the hole because these guys still need repair. Um, we do have a little bit of water stored, so hopefully that gets repaired relatively quickly. Uh, we're producing a couple of those. Um, uh, we are having children appear, though, so our population is going to uh, grow again. Uh, so that's definitely useful. Uh, the lack of fuel, I think, is uh, impacting the... Or was maybe impacting the uh, shuttles as well. Uh, yeah, here we go. We delivered some stuff up here. Yeah, okay. Water production is coming back online here. Uh, yep. We need one more machine part to get up here to uh, fix this one. Um, we are now even. Uh, uh, yeah, we're, we're roughly uh, uh, even on water now. Uh, and there we go. The other water extractor comes online. Good. Now we are... Uh, now our water uh, reserve should be uh, increasing. Yep. Um, we're short two workers still. <clears throat> but we have five children, and they will eventually uh, 
uh, come up. Now, what what we need to do is get to the point where we can start training, uh, you know, build a university and start training. But we need to get electronics production online. Uh, we don't have that yet. Uh, I'm pretty sure we don't. Yeah, so we don't have the electronics factory available yet. So uh, that's going to take um, take a while. Um, they have uh, scanned an anomaly. Yeah, uh, good for them. Um, we have... Yeah, okay. What I should do is probably turn that guy back on as well. So we can produce fuel a little bit faster. Uh, we'll go down here. Yeah, we can bring that guy home. Okay. Whoops. I didn't want to turn it. Um, you can go back up here. Yeah, okay. That's good. Where is the... Oh, uh, gene adaptation is almost done, so that's good. Uh, we still have plenty of metals that's being uh, brought in to uh, from the surface, uh, so that's good. Uh, yep, yeah, that's doing its thing. So we're producing polymers a little bit faster than we're using them. Uh, we're producing machine parts theoretically faster than we're using them, but... Uh, the problem is we had to repair so many things that all at once that it uh, it kind of uh, uh, messed with everything, right? Uh, okay, our RC commander here is uh, going to uh, going to get back to our uh, settlement here. And that'll be useful. Um, we still have lots of concrete, so uh, I'm not going to uh, build another concrete extractor just yet. Uh, it's something that would be a good idea to build at some point, but I don't need to do that just yet. Um, uh, so as a result, I'm not going to because it takes uh, maintenance, right? And uh, we don't have the, uh, the machine parts for that at the moment. Okay, we're even on employment now. Um, all the open jobs are currently filled, uh, and that's, uh, that's useful. Uh, we have four renegades. Uh, that's probably not that big of a deal. Um, right. Okay, so gene adaptation. That's our, um, that's our big uh, crops. Um, oh, oh. The Hanging Gardens, that's a really nice one. It's really expensive, though. We need deep scanning. Um, moisture farming, we definitely need. Uh, and then I need to find deep scanning. Um, that's under physics. Uh, no, we're not going to do probes. Dust repulsion might be useful. Um, Now, what we're going to do, um, we're going to take that one out. I'm going to put extractor amplification in and the uh, wind turbine upgrade. And I'm going to queue up the Stirling generator. And yeah, I'll leave that. Okay, but we will do moisture farming first uh, because I want to be able to build vaporators. Uh, and uh, once we can build vaporators, the uh, water issue goes away. Uh, we don't have to worry about finding another water source and piping it in, right? So that's the idea. And we have a cold wave coming. Uh, that's fine. We can deal with a cold wave. And we are actually coming up net positive on uh, uh, machine parts finally. Uh, that's useful. Um, the rocket is uh, not uh, fueled yet. Let's, um, oh, really? Um, yeah, okay. Uh, well, I can bring you down here. Meanwhile, let's check in on the uh, planetary anomalies. 
This one reveals new texts. That one reveals new texts. That one's research progress, but we don't have a safari. Uh, so I'm not overly concerned about those ones. Um, new tech, um, it, uh, the, the uh, resource uh, expenditure to do that, uh, not worth it. So, uh, right. Uh, okay, so we'll come down here and we'll repair our uh, rover. Uh, which is heading somewhere. It has 22 metals on board. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm not terribly worried about the, about the cold wave. Uh, as long as the buildings aren't broken, they won't freeze. And that, uh, that will, will mean that things continue operating, right? Um, we got a meteor storm. That could cause trouble if the meteors hit the actual colony. Um, yeah, so that uh, that could be an issue. But um, it could also be useful. Uh, now we're heading over here. We're going to repair the, uh, the rover. Yep. There it goes. And then we will bring this guy home At the very least i want to have him parked uh somewhere where uh, uh drones from a drone hub can get to it to uh to repair uh if it gets uh zapped or something right right okay so the the rovers are coming up there now uh we yeah okay so we've got our population filtering through and becoming seniors, right? Uh, and that's, of course, uh, going to uh, take some uh, uh, some some uh, uh, of the workforce away. But we also have uh, children coming in. Um, we've had a couple seniors pass on, so uh, that's uh, uh, caused. Uh, uh, the shift in uh, workforce that we saw there. Uh, we're up to four machine parts now. Uh, so that's actually going up. Uh, so I think if I were to turn that back on, uh, it can get repaired. And then uh, uh, we'll run it. Uh, yeah, we'll run two shifts uh, during the day. Uh, and the reason I want to do that is so it doesn't freeze during the cold wave. Uh, but it will need uh, a worker from somewhere to turn up. Uh, which uh, isn't going to happen uh, right away. Uh, yeah, because we're, uh, we're maxed out here. Uh, 3 and 1.5. What if I drop that by 2? Okay, yeah, that gets that going. Uh, that's, uh, that's pretty much what I want there. Um, we're still going to uh, produce 2 point some of the, two of these at least. So uh, I think we should be okay. Uh, it cuts our production by a third, right? So, um, low resource, yeah, because we used up the stuff we uh, we were uh, we produced, right, uh, to repair the this thing, right? Um, hmm. I'm thinking I need to do that, and maybe drop a worker out of there yeah uh, building no um, right so yeah um, no we had more another uh, uh, worker turn into a senior um, yeah uh, what's the uh, Comfort 88, Comfort 77, 
Uh, what's the, uh, the limit on the comfort here? Uh, service buildings were not supplied. Service buildings not supplied with resources. Okay, so what am I missing in this dome? Probably uh, a garden or something like that, right? Um, yeah. Okay, so we'll go into decorations. And let's put a stone garden in here, just because. Because why not? Uh, it's not going to harm anything to have it there, and uh, we have the resources to make it, right? And here, we have enough fuel for a launch. Uh, estimated time remaining 34 souls. Um, yeah, that's um, a little bit of a problem. What I should do is um, maybe move that down a little bit and uh, get extractor amplification. Um, yeah, maybe maybe low G turbines. Um, yeah, I think that's probably a good idea. Meanwhile, I'm going to go here on Earth with our cargo rocket. And uh, we don't have enough for... No. Uh, I'm going to launch this guy. So he's waiting in orbit to land. Oh, we've got two new planetary anomalies. Research progress note. That one is resources with botanists. Uh, that's unknown. Uh, I'm not going to risk eight colonists and a rocket on unknown. So, yeah, okay. Unknown is probably a breakthrough, but we could lose the entire expedition as well. And that's uh, something that I don't want to do. Uh, cold wave in seven hours, so that's going to be fun. Um, stored power, yeah, okay, fine. Um... Yeah, I think we're burning through the uh, machine parts with these guys, right? Um, yeah, I think. Uh, anyway, um, we're building up a fuel reserve, and that's uh, that's uh, something that... Uh, oh, I don't need to run uh, two of those um, now that we've caught up on fuel. Uh so that'll cut our uh, maintenance budget a little bit. And here we go. We have um, we have our uh, cold wave happening here. Um, we are we have a problematic moxie. Okay, uh, as the frost outside settles, da 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 da. da. Uh, Uh, we have the polymers. Let's do the uh, polymer thing. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that will definitely uh, allow... Allow everything to operate. Uh, we'll, we'll burn through a lot of the polymers we have. Uh, but... It will insulate everything, and then we'll have that. Uh, but then we won't end up using extra power, right? And that does seem like it's uh, kind of beneficial, right? You know, not using extra power. It's just, uh, you know, power, right? Um, okay, we only have three children. Uh, meteor storm. Okay, let's... Um, Jump out to the map overview and see where the meteors are. Oh, they're they're down here. Okay. Well, that's fine. They can be down there. And it's only going to last uh, a little under three sols. Oh, oh, we got anomalies turning up. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, that 
Yeah, of course uh, the resources are low. Uh, right. Well, uh, we've got two saws on extractor amplification. Well, we're up to 44 people. Okay, well, we do have uh, children being born at a pretty steady rate. It would be useful if they were being born a little faster. So I, I, it would be nice to get the uh, uh, the hanging gardens. Uh, then you, I could have a dome that just, that'll have like comfort of 90 or something, 95 or something like that. And that would uh, certainly allow for a high birth rate, right? Oh, we've got our, uh, our explorer coming. Um, oh, it's not complaining about um, machine parts for the moment. Um, right, okay. We have the explorer. We'll, we'll uh, scan the anomaly, right? Then we'll, we'll see what, uh, what we end up uh, picking up, right? Still five sols left in the cold wave. Um, uh, <coughs> I hope this doesn't turn into a long winter event. Okay, we're just about done. And... Uh, we have our extractor amplification. Um, and we're a long way into that. Okay, let's just go check in on the science. And we have revealed deep scanning. Bam. That is going second. I want low G turbines. Okay. Um, good. Uh... We have the uh, Explorer active. Okay. I'll just uh, park it back over here uh, while it's uh, waiting. Okay, and this guy has 19. Yeah, so I'll, I'll amplify this extractor. Um, cycle through. Okay. Fine. Um, yeah, because I'll uh, amplify the uh, uh, rare metals extractor so that we can get uh, some more uh, out of there, um, because that would be uh, useful. Uh, right. Oh, uh, what I should do is uh, go back up here, uh, go into the farm. Now, what uh, we have quinoa which does 22 in two souls. Wheat, which does 17 in two souls. Um, 1.6, okay. Um, it doesn't affect the soil quality. Um, okay, and we have 100% soil quality. So we can just switch to quinoa. That will produce more food. Okay. And uh, I think we can drop back to one guy in the farm. Uh, yeah, I think we can. Um, that seems like it's probably useful. Um, we found a new anomaly uh, from the uh, impact. Uh, we're just about done with uh, low G turbines. Uh, so by the time that gets here, um, right. Where's the explorer? Uh, it's coming across the bottom. Okay. Um, 
Wait, can I go in here? Yeah, we'll build the uh, amplification there. Okay. Uh, we have low G turbines. We don't have the polymers to upgrade all of our uh, wind turbines, but uh, uh, what I what I what it'll allow me to do is deactivate about one in four of them. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, what are we researching now? Deep scanning. Yes. Okay. We definitely want deep scanning. Uh, and then I'll, I'll just start scanning everything again. And we'll find some more anomalies and uh, deep metal, hopefully, uh, near, the, uh, near my starting point there. Uh, okay, good. That impact happened before the Explorer went by. Good. Now I just I'm just babysitting this so I can be ready to uh, to um, nope out of there if a uh, impact is going to uh, come nearby. So far so good. And we've got nine hours left in the meteor storm. Two uh, science anomalies from. A meteor storm is actually pretty good. Uh, I've had in the past cases where I got five or six, but it is uh, random. Okay. Um, okay. Now, if I uh, go up here and over here, send the explorer home. Yeah. Um, yeah, just nope right out of there. And uh, that that gave us uh, a fair chunk of the way on deep scanning. So we're only five sols away from that now. Uh, and that's, uh, that's uh, cool. Uh, okay, we've got a rocket ready to land. It's empty. No, 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 no. Um, I was uh, uh, looking for water conservation or something, wasn't I? Um, yeah, uh, moisture farming is up, uh, yeah. Okay, so I can remove Sterling Generator. Um, now, where's the factory AI? Um, sustainable architecture. Field extractors. Um, is it under robotics or? Uh, right, okay, so if I go in here, production, it's engineering. Okay, uh, engineering. Uh, so I need to uh, reveal a couple of cheap engineering techs. Uh, apartments. Yeah, that's probably a good one to reveal. Uh, okay. Uh, one hour left in the meteor storm. Yeah. Um, good. Uh, we'll go back home here. Uh, right. Okay. So here we've got 20 uh, rare metals. I am, yes, waiting to get 30 of them. Uh we have an unemployed person and two open slots. Yeah, that's always good. Um, right, we have five children, but we, ha we have nine seniors. Yeah. STEM reconstruction would probably be nice. Um, uh, is that revealed? Uh, that'd be under biotech. Uh, I think it's STEM reconstruction. Uh, rejuvenation treatment. Uh, moisture farming, hanging gardens. Now, apparently... Uh, it's one of the really expensive unrevealed ones. Okay. 
Well, that is um, uh, that is going to take a uh, minute to uh, uh, to get uh, sorted. Uh, right. Okay. Uh, close that. Uh, right. Okay. So let's just let things uh, tick along for a minute here. Uh, we're up to 21 of those. Uh, we are not keeping up on... Uh, okay. So how much uh, it uh, adds uh, one-third production. So, uh, and it takes two um, polymers, right? Yeah, it takes two polymers. <clears throat> Where is this? Um, unemployed guy. Um, let's add a second uh, work slot there. Might as well say close one of these. Yeah. And here, okay, now we've got two guys there. Um, okay, so if I upgrade that, upgrade that, and upgrade that, then I can say, uh, demolish that. Yeah. Uh, so if these guys go up by 33%, that's three of them together account for one that has that doesn't have that, right? Uh, right, okay. So that's on. That's on. That's on. Okay. Now we need to build up some more polymers, and then I can do that again. Good. Uh, we have here 22. If I put this on heavy workload, um, that may not be the uh, most ideal. We're producing one per sol. Hmm, if I do this, Oh wow! Okay, let's uh, let's try that uh, and get a few more of those out quickly. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. No, we won't land that rocket yet. We'll just store the rocket in orbit because it can't get damaged or anything by renegades or anything when it's in orbit, right? And since there's nothing on it, uh, no cargo, no passengers to die or anything like that, we don't have to worry about that aspect of things. Um, right. <sighs> now we've got ten seniors now. Yeah. Uh, we could have an issue with, um, uh, the uh, children thing. Uh, but the cold wave is only got a soul left. Um, we have a little under four souls for the, um... Uh, for the thing there. Comfort 73. Um, okay, Comfort 86. Yeah, they're taking a hit from the... Uh, uh, from the uh, cold wave. Uh, so hopefully uh, uh, that, uh, that will uh, improve things. Now here, we're up to 24. Um, good. Uh, now, what am I going to bring back from Earth? Or am I going to do some outsourcing? No, probably not. Um, right. Well, the colony hasn't died yet. So, you know, I have to give it that. Um, Yeah, that's uh, that's definitely uh, a major uh, point in its f in favor of how things are going. Um, right. Okay. Uh, uh, we are up to five polymers. Uh, right.
right. What would be useful right about now is a refugee rocket. Uh, yeah, uh, that would be kind of useful right about now. Um, there is a, a, a story event that uh, will give you a rocket with something like 25 refugees on it. Uh, not related to the mystery or whatever. I can't even remember what mystery I picked for this one. Um, right. Okay. Now I think I'm just going to uh, get rid of that one. The outlying one there. Yeah. Um, and then what I can do is I can go ahead and no I can go ahead and get rid of a wire I don't need oh, I keep clicking the wrong button uh, okay um, I can get rid of a wire I don't need uh, yeah okay that'll do okay uh, where are we at here? Well, oh, our uh, uh, workforce is uh, uh, restored. Uh, the cold wave is over. Uh, China's going for a planetary anomaly. And we have 29 rare metals in the rocket, uh, which we will launch as soon as that goes up to 30. Uh, and it'll take a couple of souls or so to, there we go, uh, we will um, launch, we'll look at the problematic moxie, reinforce the failing parts. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, okay. Why did I pick that one? Because a 10 metals cost once is much better than extra cost continually. And we have the 10 metals. So, uh, and then we can land that rocket there. Yeah. Good. Uh, yep. There's the rocket. And now we've got the rocket parked there to serve as a drone controller if uh, if we need need it right okay oh right I have the moxies turned off at night okay right now where is the science at uh, we got a solve for deep scanning yet um, and that's fine uh, we could, no, we don't have the polymers for magnetic uh, filtering. Uh, we are going to need uh, machine parts, um, or not machine parts, uh, electronics, uh, which we will, we will bring back with the uh, rocket. Uh, yeah, hopefully we'll have a, a nearly full export rocket to send out next time. Uh, uh, as well. Uh, that would be useful. That would be very useful. Right, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's, uh, building up pretty quick. Uh, we have... Well, we still have, uh, yeah, our population is uh, just hanging out. So I ne we need to increase the uh, comfort of the, uh, the domes, right? Uh, so uh, if we go and look in the science, what have we got here in biotech, um, water conservation, uh, farm automation, no. 
Uh, right. Moisture farming. Um, no. Oh, yeah, we got that queued up already. Um, okay, yeah. Nothing in there is terribly uh, brilliant. Um, right, we've, we've, we've revealed deep scanning, uh, and we're looking for now... Uh, we're looking for uh, uh, the tech for building um, whatchamahoosits. Uh, electronics, yeah. Uh, we, uh, I'm going to queue up Martian education so that we can uh, uh, build Martian universities eventually. Uh, because that will be uh, terribly useful as well. Um, oh, uh, I want to check something here. Uh, have we revealed Martian uh, patents? Uh, no, we haven't. Okay, what's this one? Yeah, we don't need to worry about that. Um, that might interact with uh, asteroid missions, though. And uh, uh, so we might want to research it at some point anyway. Uh, we have three of those um right okay so we're a third of the way back to earth um this rocket's ready to launch whenever we have whatever exports we want yeah uh okay and this is producing about four a sol uh so that would be seven more sols before it's uh ready uh yeah okay that's fine uh okay and we're going to need, uh, yeah, we're going to need to call up a supply pod with those, I think. Yeah. Do we have any supply pods? We do have a free supply pod. Okay. Well, that's okay then. Uh, right. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to put the cut here. And uh, next time... Uh, We'll deal with uh, the deep scanning and also uh, get, uh, hopefully get uh, moisture vaporators online. Uh, and then uh, that we won't be dependent on, uh, uh, as dependent on uh, these uh, resources here. Ah, uh, just before I go, here is the thing that I, uh, I, this is the uh, payoff for the thing we did last time where we helped out the new guys. So uh, we helped a fledgling colony establish foothold on Mars. China has not forgotten the favor and they send us a gift. Um, so uh, we receive several supply pods with gifts. Now take a look at this. A hundred electronics, a hundred polymers, and a hundred machine parts, right? This is why I risked it with the, um, uh, the, uh, uh, losing the, the colonists, uh, because of that, right? Uh, oh, I can just, uh, I can just land these over here. Um, yeah. Um, right, so that solves the um, supply shortage. So we won't need the uh, uh, the uh, supply pod to sort out our shortages here. Uh, we'll be good. And that uh, that is exactly... Uh, what we needed. So what I'm going to do here, because now we have the polymers, polymers I'm going to do the upgrade on those, and I'm going to do the upgrade on the Moxies. Uh, and b with that extra time, uh, we have got deep scanning, so let's set up uh, the scanning around our starting point. Yeah, uh, so we'll do that. Um, and I suppose, yeah, we can put the, uh, last one there. Okay. 
So uh, that is going to be, uh, that's definitely going to be the cut point now. Uh, so, uh, you know, like, comment, subscribe, you know the drill. And uh, of course, uh, you can dislike if you prefer. And there's also uh, the bell. If you turn that on, you get some notifications of new videos and you might find that useful. Anyway, see you back next time.